Hello folks and welcome to today's video. Today is my first day here in Moile Bois. I arrived yesterday on a coach and so today I'm going to be taking it easy and I've got plans to go to a beach called Panak Sama. It looks incredibly beautiful and I want to go there, relax by the ocean and uh, take in this nice weather and breeze that's out here today. I've rented a Honda Click directly from the guest house in which I'm staying in. Um, I got that for 500 pesos. It's a 150cc motorbike. Really nice, really modern. I mean, it's the first motorbike where the actual speedometer actually works. So that's great. And I'm gonna jump on it now and head there. Oh yeah, look at that. Safety first as always, Mergs. Listen to it turn on, it's so silent. Are you ready? Kickstand is up. It's amazing, right? Anyway. Right, so the Panaksan beach here in Wild Wild is about a nine minute drive and it's pretty much straight on. But this town, Wild Wild, is a nice little sleepy town by the west coast of Cebu. And uh, from my first impressions of it, I think it's really like only one street essentially. I've not been to the other side where the beach is, but um, the area in which I'm staying at is very small. It's literally just this one street here that kind of curves around in an L shape. Uh, there's a basketball court over there, which I'm planning to go play a bit of basketball later on uh, in the day when it's a little cooler. But yeah, I think this is town center and I love it. It's so small. It's so small, it's like literally just one street that goes up and down and it's got a 7-Eleven, it's got a McDonald's, it's got uh, everything you could ever want. The 7-Eleven is really convenient. If you saw my previous video, I bought like quite a few Shao Pao. Uh, I ate four yesterday. But here is where we need to turn left to go to Panaksam. Panaksama Beach? Is that what it says? Yeah, anyway. Bada bing, bada boom. This is the road. Not a brilliant one. Uh, it's got a few potholes here and there, but it's all right. Yeah, mate, we're on an adventure here in the Philippines. Man, what a brilliant day it is today. There is kind of like a faint veil of cloud covering the sun, so uh, it's not too strong at this moment in time, but the sun is out. You might be wondering to yourself, Morgan, where's your bag? Where's your stuff? Well, because this is a Honda Click, and uh, it's a 150cc motorbike, it's slightly bigger than the one I rented out, which was a 125cc uh, Bumblebee, yeah you would have seen in the previous video. So I've got all my stuff located in the um, seat compartment, yes. I've got my bag, I've got my swimming trunks, I've got my towels, uh, pretty much everything I need. I've got so many things planned here for Moa Bar. I've really gone to town with my research, so uh, upcoming videos are gonna be super impressive and I can't wait to do them. They're gonna be a lot more adventurous. Uh, it's gonna feature hiking, waterfalls, uh, beaches, a little bit of free diving here and there. Yeah. I'm pretty much going to cover every aspect of Wild Wild here in Cebu. Anyway, without further ado, let's carry on to the beach. Woohoo! <laughs> I don't think this is it. I think we need to go further down this way. I'm not exactly sure. Oh, sorry, sorry. I'm lost. Uh, no, I want to go to Panag Panagsama Beach. To here, yeah? yeah. Oh, okay, thank you. Do you like to do activities? Uh, I'm not ready for the activities because I don't have my GoPro charge. But uh, tomorrow, yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Did probably. Come here? Did I just come here? Yeah. yeah. Uh, today's my first day. My name is Vishan. Okay, how much are the activities? 500 each. 500 per person? Yeah. What is that for snorkeling? Yeah, yeah snorkeling. You or free see. diving? No, only snorkeling. Oh, snorkeling. If you do okay. also free diving, we have also. Okay, okay. So, what does snorkeling involve? Just like. Yeah, snorkeling is just say uh, sardines, million of sardines and turtles. Oh, okay, okay. So, if you go free dive, uh, like uh, you go down, and, uh, uh, and it teaches you how to go deep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Okay, thank you very much, Mark. What's your name, bro? Mergen. Marvin. Marvin? Professional. Can I get one? Yeah, sure, sir. Aha, Yeah, I'll Good. Yeah, so 
vlogging my experience. It's good, sorry. Love. You have a good ah. one. I will beg you. Oh really? Is it really like this? Is that no like beach? Oopsie. <laughs> oh man, so speaking to this lady, she says a typhoon wrecked the beach. That's why it looks like this. Is this true, sir? Mark, yeah. That's right. You do here. You start here going there. Yeah, yeah, but is, is the beach is the beach like this because uh, the yeah. typhoon? Yeah, of the typhoon. Oh my goodness. Okay. There used to be sand here, yeah? Yeah, before. We have a lots of sand yeah a lot of sand oh man that is dreadful because the waters look crystal clear i can see it from here but uh yeah. this doesn't look very nice to like relax on does it <laughs> this is the sardine area yeah, yeah. oh nice nice very nice 500 500 peso per person yeah only you alone is that with a tour guide so are you the tour guide yeah. oh okay i see only me alone yeah i'm alone yeah is that an island over there? Yeah, it's uh, Pescador Island. Pesca is that Pescador Island? Yeah. Oh, wow. Look at the devastation that the typhoon caused to this beach. It's so sad. I'm not sure if any restoration work has actually happened or not. It doesn't look like it. I mean, it looks like any restoration work that has gone, that has taken place, has been from the ocean in itself. Oh. Hello, how's it going? Oh, look at those waters. So uh, if I'm to do the sardine run and the uh, swimming with the turtles, um, it's happening over there where those uh, boats are. You see the fisherman boats? People have advised to do it with a tour guide because the currents can be strong, supposedly. Uh, and Mark is charging me 500 pesos. I did actually come into contact with one guy last night who uh, was like, yeah, I can do 300 pesos. <laughs> These guys are curious about my vlog. Hello. How are you? Are you Filipino? Oh, wait, I know you. Yeah, I saw you yesterday. <laughs> hey, how's it going? It took me a while to recognize your face because you're so far away. How you doing? I didn't meet you yesterday, did I? Yeah, he wasn't in there. Oh, okay, yeah. Mergen. What, well, Morpheus? No, no, it's not Morpheus. I, I this this ain't the Matrix. Where are you from? <laughs> I'm from the UK. UK? Yeah, yeah. And how come you guys are here just chilling? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I know, I know. I just managed to finish my hot shower this morning and the power went out. And so I was like trying to get changed in the dark, you know. Yeah. It was getting kind of hot and stuffy because the aircon wasn't working. I was just dying. Yeah, it's all hot. But yeah, no electricity, man. Hey, what's up, bud? You okay? Can you smell other doggies? No. Shouldn't be able to. So what's your plan for today? Well No I plan. Just woke up. I just plan to go Wait, are you like brothers and sisters or? No, no, no we just, no, met, we just last met last night. Last night. Are oh, you met last night? Yeah. At seven eleven? No. Uh, um, Blue Mango. Oh Blue Mango, but you you work at Blue Mango, right? Or no? I did. And oh, I you went did. With the staff. Yeah, 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 yeah. Because so that's why I met you guys outside of seven eleven, right? Mm, mm, mm. You're a local? Yeah. Oh, okay, nice. If you have plans, if you got plans where you could visit some amazing places. I've got so, I've got like a huge bucket list of things that I want to do here. So I'm going to be here for like four or five days. Um, yeah. But because it's my first day here. First day? Yes, it is my first day. I arrived on a bus from Cebu City to here. I mean, how you guys know where, you where to go? Yeah. Well, so from the research I mean, I've done, trainers, so. from yeah. the research I've done, um, you you go to as close as possible to the peak, and then the climb to the peak is about fifteen minutes. Fifteen to twenty minutes. Yeah. yeah. Is, yeah. You know that, right? Yeah. Okay. I know. Good. So. I am a local. My source is uh, being verified by your source. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So it should be easy. Fifteen twenty it's minutes. Easy. Is, it's super easy. Yeah. yeah. So uh, the only difficult part is waking up at 4 a.m. 4? 4 a.m. Yeah, it's a good time, 4 a.m. So you to can be see the sunset, sunrise. How far is it from here? I think it's like an Three. hour, right? One hour and 30 minutes. So I think we have to actually wake up maybe 2 a.m. No. I'm thinking no. about when I did Mount Fuji. 
uh, when I was in Japan, when I climbed it, because mm-hmm. I did the sunrise for Mount Fuji. Uh-huh. We, we woke up at 2 a.m. to start hiking to the top. And if the drive to Osmania Peak is going to be an hour, one maybe hour we... One hour and 30 minutes, yeah. One hour and 30 minutes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. By the time we arrive there, it'll be 3 30. <laughs> maybe we'll get lost along the way, another 30 minutes. I know the road. She knows the road, though. You know the road? Yeah. You've done it before? Yeah. So you want to do it again? Yeah. Why? Because I want to see the sunrise. Oh, okay, fair, fair, fair. Yeah. That's good. Yeah, That's because good we, were been, I, we, we were actually talking about yeah, it. Yeah, we were talking he, about it. And then, like, you came along, so... Oh, you were talking about it, really? Yeah, yeah we were talking about because it. I told him, I better you go that. to Osmania Peak or visit some falls. There's too many, too many falls here. Uh-huh. Yeah. You hop. You hop in there. No, I need to call you uh, I'll I tell you, right? <laughs> Oh, that's no, yeah, that's right, that's right, that's, that's right. right. No, 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 that's grandma. Yeah. Well, what is it? What's the older sister one? Um, mine now. Mine now? No, no, no. I didn't wait. Mine now. I thought I called older sister. Mine now. Mine now. You don't even know? How do you not know? Huh? Um, different, di- different, different dialect. Oh, different dialect. Oh, okay. What dialect is that? Or is that Tagalog? Visaya. Ah, Visaya. Uh, I know a bit of Visaya. I know how to say Lami. Lami Kayo. Lami Kayo, yeah, yeah, yeah. Guapo Kayo. Guapo Kayo. Guapo Kayo. Guapo Kayo. Guapo Kayo. Guapo Kayo. Well, I went to like, I went to a barber in the mountains in Sedgwick City, right? Yeah. And I needed a haircut and I was like, you know what? This is so you're going to make me Guapo Kayo? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Are you guys just going to chill here or do you want to go to the beach? White sand beach. Yeah, should I get the white beach? Oh. Okay. Can you swim or you don't have trunks? <laughs> I think you're right. Uh, I, I can yeah. swim. You have trunks as well? You have like your yes. swim? Un- okay. Yeah, yeah maybe we'll do that. Alright. Yeah. Hello, sir. How are you? Don't buy it, baby. Alright. Guys, I forgot your names. Jeremiah. German. Jeremiah. Jeremiah, Jeremiah okay. Have and you huh? Tried? You don't even know her name? Oh yeah, because you met her last night. Yeah, <laughs> Gee, this is happening with me. I was in drunk. No. Lexi. <laughs> Lexi. No, you don't introduce, uh, uh, same, you don't introduce same me, me sa, ano, to yourself. Sa IG mo, no? Lexi. Lexi. Yeah, she didn't tell me her name, did she? Because I would have remembered Lexi. It's quite an easy name. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Is that is that your like Filipino name or your like? That's my fake name. Oh, your fake name. Oh, what's your Filipino name? What's your Marlin? Fil- Marlin? Yeah, like a fish. Marlin. 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 Yeah. Marlin. Marlin. Why? Well, it's similar to my name, first of all. Isn't that like a male name? Marlin. Marlin. Like a fish. Like, like a blue Marlin. Like Merlin. Yeah. Marlin. Marlin. Yeah, anyway. That's my okay. fake name, Lexi. All right. What all right. are you guys saying? So you're 34. gonna change? It's ready for I. I've I'm... got my clothes in my um. Okay. I'll just get my motorcycle. Okay. okay. It's right there. Okay. So. Wow, look, I've made new by friends. Six o'clock, wow. I, have, I have to give the motorcycle back. So oh, 6 p.m. you have to give the motorcycle. Okay. So it's plenty of time. Yeah, there's quite a lot of time. Yeah. It's really 4 or 7. Yeah. Yeah, it's we're only okay. going to be there for like an hour. I'm yeah. Gonna, I'm yeah, not going to be good. like, oh, let's stay here all night. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I need to pay. I need to pay. I paid already. Oh, you, you paid already? Oh, thank you so much. Oh, how much is that? Oh. Bye bye, Thank you. Thank you. Wow, Philippine hospitality at its finest. Got my. That's what we're famous for. Yeah, I know you're famous for that, aren't you? Right. Everybody seems to like talk about it because this beach is not in a state to relax on. Um, we're gonna go to White Beach, which is just down the road. I think it's like a minute or two minutes away, and I'm going with uh, Lexi and Jeremiah. Hello, welcome to my vlog. Uh, wait, wait, where do we need to wait for Jeremiah? Oh, we'll wait here, okay. Yeah. All right. Where's your bike? My bike's there. Oh, okay. Yeah. The first one. Yeah, the first one. After tomorrow, I will buy tomorrow. Yeah, she just spent 35 okay. pesos on you know, my drink. It's okay because, I know, I know, because he's asking me to buy a school supply. School supply? Yeah. What's that? Like a notebook. Oh, yeah, school so supply. Oh, yeah, so how much him, is that? I told him, like, I'm tomorrow, I'm gonna buy tomorrow for him. Oh, uh, okay. How much is that? Not a lot, though. Uh, I, I, I'm curious because I want to buy it for him, too. 
School supply? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Where, where are the books? In the mountains. Uh, in the mountains. No, no. Oh, in the mountains. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's... Sorry. In the town. Sorry. Okay, okay, okay. In the town, all right. Yeah, in the town. Yeah. Tomorrow. Tomorrow? I can do today, kid. <laughs> but we have to go, right? Yeah, but we can go to town after the white beach. Oh, okay. So we can go to the town. Okay. Yeah, it's still open. Yeah, 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 I'll buy you some some books. I support education. <laughs> All right, White Beach, here we come. All right, I've just stopped. Are you want to eat? Come, come, come. You, you don't look in good health. Oh, can I get one fried chicken? Only one? For the dog, only. For the doggy, yeah. For the dog? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Free chicken, free chicken for the dog. Free chicken? Yeah, oh, yeah, oh, the dog is very hungry. He might die from, uh, you know, no, no. his stomach might explode. No, no, no. It's okay. The you chicken know, is a little very bit. small. Which chicken? This one? Yes. Chicken wing, huh? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay. How many? Free, yeah? How much for free? For three? Yeah, how many? 90 pesos. Okay, go. For the dog! Give to the dog! Thank you. Thank you. Oh, here your chain. That's okay. Thank, Thank you. you so much. You're welcome. Come on. I'm trying to now. Eat it. Watch out, watch out. Good boy. Good boy. You look energetic now. Your tail's up. Second, I need to get my trunks out and everything like that. Oh, it's gonna be a headache. All right. Why wouldn't I go up? Oh, I think that's because I've got so many things in here. There we are. Yes, look at that. It's packed. <laughs> Maximum capacity. An umbrella. Okay, you think my helmet will be okay? Yeah. Sorry? There's a lot of people watching me. So. Oh, okay. Is that a good thing then? Um, no, not I. I wouldn't do it, but you know, for me. Ah, yes, this is something more like it. Woo. Okay, wow, this is nice. Ooh. This is good, man. Feels like a peninsula. Because you see how like it kind of goes out like that? It's not really a peninsula, but a deal is like one. Yes, the rainbow's still here, wow. Okay, let's find a place to set up camp. Here. Here, okay. Okay, I've jumped into my trunks. Um, let's just take a look at the water here at White Sand Beach in Wabwa. Whoa! Oh! Oh! It's so warm! It's really warm! Look at this! This is like Boracay vibe, I would say. I really want the sun to come out. Whoa! We're gonna go into the waters! I'm in. What about you guys? What does that mean? Rocky, okay. Up till now, this is the warmest sea that I've been in, or ocean, whatever you want to call it. Yeah. This is the warmest waters. Oh, in other countries, it's freezing. If you go to Croatia, France, that like you go to Nice, you go to. Um, uh, Dubrovnik split. The water is ice cold. I'm not joking. But here in the Philippines, look at it. It's like a sauna. But I can't believe how blue the water gets over there. It's deep. Yeah. You want to go? You. No, you're joking. You see fish? Yeah, I can see it on camera better. That's so weird how I can see it on camera better, but not through my own eyes. Yeah. Today, today we're not here for like. You know, snorkeling, we're just here for relaxing in the ocean. Tomorrow's a big day, yeah. Tomorrow's big, big, big day. Big day. Yes, so many people keep recommending I go north to 
to Batania and Ireland. Yeah, they say the beaches are spectacular. Yeah. I mean, are they better than Boracay or no? Almost the same. Almost the same. Yeah. Really? Yeah. It's that. It's that soft. That's amazing. Powdery sand. I've never experienced powdery sand ever. Okay. No joke. Yeah. It kind of makes it difficult to walk around these parts because of the corals and the rocks. Yeah, I know. It's not so easy to stay in one place. <laughs> All you've got to do is just find a bit of flat, flat seabed and then stand there. Yeah, look, yeah, look, Jer Jeremiah's doing it. He's found this kind of little bit of land that I'm connected to as well. Lexi here's trying to find fish, I don't know. I don't know what she's thinking. She's probably thinking like, yeah, I'm going to go and eat that tonight. <laughs> but I've lost my balance. I've lost my balance. I've lost my spot. Bloody hell. And um, now I'm kind of like standing on rocks, which is not a good idea. Whoa, what is that? What is that orange thing, bro? Do you see the orange thing? Yeah. Like so when you have a typhoon in a place like this, what what do you do? Do you hop on the motorbike and run, or like drive away? It depends on how no, no, I'm talking about like serious, like, serious oh, yeah, typhoon. You gotta go to an evacuation center. You gotta go to an evacuation center because uh, that's been on my mind. That's been on the back of my mind. Like, what if a massive typhoon comes in and it like yeah. <gasps> destroys everything? Like, what does one do in that scenario? Because my, my natural instinct would be, okay, jump on the motorbike and then just go in the opposite direction. Go in the opposite direction from the bloody typhoon. And I don't know if that would be successful. It wouldn't be because... Because the winds would be so strong, right? Yeah, you'd just be blown over and then you'd be like flying in the air. So what, you've got to go to like an evacuation centre underground or what? No, that's like... A school? But are they strong? Yeah. yeah. What? They're sturdy. They're sturdy. Okay. Or find like an underground camper. <laughs> something from like a World War Two. No, I don't want to eat ballot. I want to eat something Robin. nice. Yeah. So, like any good restaurants around here? Yeah. Um, oh. That sounds interesting. Is it expensive? Um, for for the both of us, I paid like eight hundred. Oh, that's good. Where, yeah. Where, where, where? In Lanta, uh, was it? In where? Lanta. 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 And how much? How much uh, are you Lanta. looking to pay? The meal, the meal like two hundred thirty. Whoa, that's good. Masarap, yeah. Uh, uh, lamik. Lamik kayo. Lamik kayo, yeah. Okay. Okay, lamik kayo. I want to eat lamik kayo. Something very delicious. Okay, so that's the next plan, I guess. Once we're out. Look. The sun is making its brief appearance behind the clouds. It's getting really nice, yeah. That's only gonna like be around for like a few minutes and then it'll set. Yeah. Okay, goodbye sunset. See you tomorrow. Oh yeah, see you tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> On the other side. <laughs> That's brilliant. See you Didn't realise it was gonna be the same sun. <laughs> Not gonna lie, it's really hard to get out of this beach. I'm almost there. There's a lot of rocks here. There we are. Made it. We've just left White Sand Beach and uh, it's still blackout. It's been blackout for about the last three hours. I hope it doesn't go on all night because then. Um, I won't be able to upload this video. We've come to a restaurant, but I can't remember the name. Do you remember the name? No. Okay, <laughs> me and Jeremiah, no idea. But it's by, by the beach, and our oh, lantern. And it overlooks onto the ocean. Oh, Tanan, Tanau. So you might be wondering to yourself, how on earth can this restaurant cook? Well, we're in Asia people, they use a fire. Yeah, it's a fire and a wok. And we have Madam cooking over here. How are you, Madam? Are you using a fire? Yes, you are. Gas cooker. <laughs> brilliant, brilliant. This is it. Oh, it smells delicious. This is what? The fish curry Sumatra. Wow, it smells yeah. so good. And this one is the adobo. Adobo? Ah, yeah. you do adobo here. Yeah, it's brilliant. Adobo. 
Look at that, they've got a candle there. Two candles. Candle. Lighting up the place. Love it. I feel like when there's no electricity, people bond together better. Uh, it smells like meat. La meat yeah. Smells, yeah. yeah. Which one? The fish adobo? Curry Sumatra, where we have the adobo. Okay, fish curry Sumatra, okay. Mm. Alright, I'll tell my friends that I'm gonna order that. Alright. Yeah. Thank you so much. Oh, uh, you went with green curry? Yeah. The chef recommended we go with fish curry okay. Sumatra. You're getting that one. Yeah. Well, it's gonna be shared, isn't it? Yeah. So. It's stir fried chicken. Yeah, yeah that's fine as well. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. Hey. Cheers. 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 <laughs> it's quite spicy. No way! Oh, that's brilliant. Happy birthday to you. Happy, yeah! Look at that. Woo! My birthday. Twenty-three. Blow out the candle. <laughs> well done. You're now twenty-three. Way. So this is the night area of Moabois. And uh, this is where we ate. Okay. Kampai. Oh no. How do you say in, in Filipino? Tagay. Tagay. Kampai, school, Tagay. Is it Tagay? Yeah. Oh. You have to drink all down. No. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> yeah, I know you're kidding. <laughs> oh. Tastes like Heineken. Mm. Yeah. Okay, folks. Uh, we finished with our drink here at Chili Bar. But uh, I'm going to wrap up today's video here because we've got a long day ahead of us tomorrow we're gonna have to wake up really early at 2 a.m to go to osmania peak but if you enjoyed today's video subscribe to the channel for me like this video and share this video with friends and family and i will see you in the next video here on the channel many thanks for watching take care and bye from moi bois